Why wouldn't Emily and I work out? You know all the reasons as well as I do. No. Starting with this. Carly, Carly, Carly. Where did that come from? That was just a reminder of what Emily could never give you. What I do with Emily is none of your business. All right? I disagree. It affects my children, Jason, and you, for that matter. You don't like Emily. Fine. But kissing me was a bad idea. Okay, maybe you're right. We agreed that we were going to not go back, right? Yeah. We would only hurt each other, and I never want to hurt you again. You know, there was a time when I couldn't imagine living in my own home without you. I felt less than whole if I didn't wake up with you next to me. You're my heart. You are everything, good and bad. Without you, I thought I had nothing. You're doing better now. And I'm glad for that. We're never going to get back, you know. The time we lost, but we got two beautiful children now. We, we, we're gonna have that bond forever. But kissing me, you know, it's not a good idea for either of us. I came here tonight to check on Michael. I didn't, you know, I, I mean, I'm not saying, I'm not trying to push my way back into your life. No, well, that's good. Matter of fact, it's just the opposite. Well, I didn't kiss you because I wanted you back. I kissed you because I was proving to you that I'm strong enough to walk away. Even though I will always miss what we used to have. Me too. But it's not good to always look back and see the good parts of me. On the island and... Those times we take the boys to Bobby's and spend three days in, in bed straight, you know, on the beach. All those times on the beach when I'd hear you laugh. And, uh, it was a great times, and I'm glad, and I'm glad we had them. So am I. But it cost you. Being with me, living with me, I didn't mean to hurt you. But I did. And despite all those times that, you know, I wake up in the middle of the night, reach out for you, you're not there. I, I think about the time when I saw you at the gates curled up in a ball, crying like a baby, like nobody I've ever seen. Terrified. Look, I've... I've accepted now. That being with me makes you less than what you are. I respect you and I love you too much to let that happen again. You know, there's this saying, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. And it's a totally obnoxious <laughs> saying, but I think it rings true for me and for us. Mm -hmm. I survived the worst. And now I'm back on my feet and I have no plans to fall again. Mm -hmm. And what I want is for both of us, separately, mm -hmm. to be okay. So you know what? You don't have to protect me from me. I just really want you to be okay. And I'll do the same. So does that mean you won't be... The button into my business. Uh, uh, sure. As long as you won't butt into mine. I don't butt into your business, do I? Oh, no, no, no. You never, ever butt into my business, honey. No. No. Nah. Well, nah. you're still paying the butt. But a little bit. <laughs> it takes one to know one. 